think Jerrica is a really strong girl. I think she's had to deal with a lot in her life and a lot more than the typical 16 year old. And um, I'm proud of her for sticking with it and staying strong and working really hard to improve herself. Um, my name is Jerrica Kaufman. I go to Central. I am a sophomore. I'm 16 years old and I have kidney failure. I have renal failure. Both of my kidneys failed December the 9th of 2010. I mean, someone to say what it's like. Ready, set, go! Beep. Beep. Good job. When I got a kidney transplant, I was on the list and it's like a lot of work up. You have to do all these doctor's appointments. You have to go to the dentist to see if everything's okay. It's a thorough exam. I was on the list for six months. I got my kidney in May, May 20th, 30th of 2011. I had it for five years. And I got my kidney a week before the last day of school before I was getting ready to graduate fifth grade. And they called the school, well, my grandmother, and they called the school and told me I was getting a kidney transplant. And I left, went to the hospital. kids and adults about my cheeks being big because of the steroids that I take to help the kidney and there's a lot a lot of medication but mainly the steroids it makes you puff up and stuff and I got joked on or bullied about so I lost my kidney because I stopped taking the medication I was listening to other people when I shouldn't have so at the end of the day it affects you and not the so don't listen to them. You're beautiful inside and outside. <laughs> start rotting it and I had to remove the kidney because it was really painful. I'm back on dialysis Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And I'm not able to hang out with my friends as much. I stay sick. Well, not, I don't stay sick, but sometimes I don't feel good. And it's just a lot. get to do everything that I want to do, like do cheerleading and gymnastics and things like that, going to practice and all that because I'm always at dialysis. So it changed my life a lot. Dialysis is where they hook you up to two lines, blue and red, and one returns the blood to the machine and one takes out the blood of your body and clean it. They clean the toxins, the fluid, cleans your blood. Do some, it's an artificial kidney. They do what your kidneys are not doing and what your kidneys are supposed to be doing. If I get a kidney, I'm going to take care of it this time, not listen to other people, do what's right, not what's wrong. Because at the end of the day, I am my own person, and I'm not living for them, I'm living for myself. And in the future, I plan to be a nephrologist, a pediatrician nephrologist. I plan to have children, be married, and live a happily ever after life.